The Death of Socrates is an oil-on-canvas painting created by French painter Jacques-Louis David in 1787. The painting depicts the final moments of Socrates, the famous philosopher of ancient Greece who was sentenced to death by drinking poison hemlock. The painting is part of the neoclassical style, which was popular in the 1780s and depicted subjects from the classical age. In the painting, an elderly Socrates is dressed in a white robe and sits upright on a bed, surrounded by his friends of varying ages, most showing emotional distress, unlike Socrates, who remains calm. The young man handing him the cup looks the other way, with his face in his free hand. Crito listens intently to his teacher's words while clutching his knee. An elderly man, Plato, sits at the end of the bed, slumped over and looking in his lap. To the left, other men are seen through an arch set in the background wall. On the stairway in the background, Socrates' wife Xanthippe takes a wistful glance backward at the scene. Jacques-Louis David uses color to highlight the emotion in this painting. The shades of red are more muted on the edges of the painting and become more vibrant in the center, culminating in the dark red robe of the man holding the cup of poison, generally taken as offering the cup to Socrates rather than receiving it after Socrates had consumed its contents. The only two serene men, Socrates and Plato, are garbed in a contrasting bluish-white. David simplifies the scene by removing many characters originally described in the dialogues of Plato. He also displayed some artistic license in representing the ages of many of the pupils of Socrates, including Plato. Socrates, while elderly, is depicted as rather more handsome and fit than a 70-year-old of his era would be in a more realistic depiction. His face is also much more idealized than the classical bust that is typically used as a reference portrait of Socrates. The Death of Socrates is a masterpiece that captures the essence of the final moments of the philosopher. The painting reflects the enlightenment values of truth, rationality, and self-control that Socrates embodied, and that were highly valued in the 18th century. The creation of the painting is also fascinating. Rather than a royal commission, David received a direct private commission for the work in 1786 from the wealthy Charles Michel Trudain de la Sablière, who was intrigued by a drama that Denis Diderot had considered writing but never completed. One of the dramatic scenes that Diderot's unfinished work included was Socrates' death, which led to the commission for a painting. David had created an initial treatment of the painting as early as 1782, and he returned to this early composition now that he had a commission. He consulted Father Jean Adri, a Hellenist and scholar on the subject, on the circumstances of Socrates' death. One of Adri's letters has survived, he recommended that Plato should be shown as immobile, although Plato was not actually present, that Crito be shown with more emotion, and that Apollodorus should be visibly filled with emotion. The Death of Socrates is a remarkable painting that captures the essence of one of the most significant moments in the history of philosophy. Jacques-Louis David's masterful use of color, composition, and emotion makes the painting an enduring masterpiece that continues to inspire and captivate viewers today. For anyone interested in learning more about Socrates, I highly recommend reading The Trial and Death of Socrates by Plato. This book is a collection of four dialogues written by Plato, a student of Socrates, that explore the events leading up to Socrates' trial and subsequent execution. Through the dialogues, readers can gain a deeper understanding of Socrates' philosophy and his unwavering commitment to seeking truth and wisdom, even in the face of death. The Trial and Death of Socrates is a thought-provoking and insightful read that provides valuable insight into the life and teachings of one of history's most influential philosophers. If you found this video interesting, don't miss the one on the screen. Thank you for your support. See you in the next video.